Take a look at this. According to the February report by Rentals.ca, Edmonton's average rent for condominiums increased by 17.1%. On the other hand, one-bedroom apartment in Edmonton increased by 19.1%. With the cost of rent in bigger cities like in Edmonton increasing, could a small city like Lloyd Minister affected by the change? Yes, but certainly not to the extent of what the Edmonton and Calgary markets are. This is what Jennifer Gilbert said when I asked about the future of rent prices in Lloyd Minster. Gilbert said that the city is still having good vacancy rate, ranging from 7 to 8 percent, compared to Edmonton's and Calgary's 2 to 3 percent. So what we're seeing in Edmonton and Calgary markets, they're basically dealing with a vacancy rate right now around 2 to 3 percent. We still have fairly stable rental inventory. There's definitely some certain subsections of inventory that's harder to come by than others. Lloyd Minster expected to have 10 to 20 percent increase in rent pricing compared to Edmonton's 40 to 70 percent. According to Gilbert, the increase of rent can be the result of changes in owners' expenses. It's been very kind of balanced for what our owner expenses have been from 2015 through to today. Um, but with these increases in carbon taxes, the increases in interest rates, uh, the main driving force behind the rental increases is ultimately, number one, the owner's um, need to mitigate their damages. They need to mitigate the loss. Despite the increase of rent costs in Canada, Edmonton is still considered to be one of the cheapest places to live and rent according to Rental.ca report. Tenil Zellweger with EXP Realty in Lloyd Minster said that many people from Vancouver and Ontario are moving to certain cities in Alberta, including the border city. We've had a lot of people over the last couple of years that came from Ontario, BC, where house prices were so much higher. So they were actually selling, say, their downtown townhouse, they're selling it, moving to Lloydminster, getting almost triple the space for half of the amount of money. Moving from bigger centers like in Vancouver or Toronto, they are more migrating towards Edmonton and Calgary if possible. And then obviously everything trickles down to Lloydminster as well. According to Gilbert, whether the rental prices and housing market change over time, she requires every applicant to provide information needed by the real estate agency to ensure the qualification to rent a house in the city. Leo Cruzat, Primetime, Local News.